Hello and welcome back to Dying Light. Last time we made a daring escape from Rice's compound, but sadly, poor Dr. Zier was killed. Now we've got to go meet Troy in a new area of the city, and we've located the people who can take us there. Okay. We'll get you to so the let's do side. it. Right when? Right now. Right now? That's exciting. What you did to Rice. All right, Locked so they're the like, aye, down. fair enough, ah, you're a pro. Pure took his hand off, we did. We hacked Rice's hand clean off in one swoop. It was fantastic. It was one of the most satisfying things that have ever happened because he's a horrible cunt. And that's the irony, because the first time we saw him, he chopped a man's hand off and now he's been hoist by his own petard, so to speak. Anyhow, now we've got to find a tunnel leading out of the slums and that's exciting because this is a... This is a whole new world we're going into. Oh. Either way, we've got to do a little bit of avoidance before we get there, but I figure let's rescue this pal. Give him the old boot to the side of the head. That's right, we've got Stomp now. Nay, but there, pal, I do try. We're all in this together, an achievement for getting 15 survivors, and I've rescued five. Is he really? Oh, bollocks to him, he doesn't deserve to live if he just ran right into a zombie. Who am I to play God, you may say? It's like, well... Aye, fair enough, I'll give you that. I can't decide who lives and dies, but... I'll do it anyway. Because in lieu of God... Or whoever... I figure I might as well do my best, eh? Let's do a roll. Oh! Done a sweet slide! <laughs> Shame it didn't do anything! Run, Crane, run! Let's get out of the way. Oh, hang on. We're just sort of glitching into the wall there. Oh, upsy daisy. Right, let's check the map. What's the best way to get there? Oh, definitely around this side. Right. Let's see if we can. Oh, my word, that was dangerous. Now I'm going to show off something cool that the camouflage skill lets us do. So we punt this guy's head off, and then we get the option to smear ourselves in his entrails. And lockpicking doesn't count as an action, so it won't break the, uh... Wait, is this thing? Yeah, it won't break the camouflage, which is exciting. Which me oh, which means now we can get some pretty sweet equipment. By being... Oh, dear. Hang on. Maybe we'll have to kill someone else. Well, even now... <laughs> even now that we've got this excellent new ability, we still find ourselves... Oh, we're we're in a crowd. Even th now that we've got this sweet new ability, we still find ourselves stuck in a crowd full of zombies. Let's kill this one. God, that's sitting him flying. His head just burst. And we can smear ourselves in his gore. Lovely. And that should give us ample opportunity to try this one again. It is very hard lockpick, so it's not meant to be easy. Oh, found it. There we are. Let's see what we've got. See what goodies lurk within. A tipped cleaver. Lovely. Don't know what that's doing in the back of a police car. I'm not, not sure cleavers are standard issue, but either way, you never know. Sorry, I'm just uh, sorting the timer that I use to count down. So I'll have to take five away from that. Oh, right. Let's go get that tunnel. This bloody stretch of highway. I'm pretty sure I run through, run down this way at least three times per episode. At least. Well, we're on our way now anyway. Travelling ever onward. I wonder if we can survive the fall into the bus. Let's make it happen. Forward roll! Oh, Crane. Didn't forward roll, but he definitely made it. We should be reaching the tunnel that we're looking for just about now. It's probably just over this way. Let's just do the old... Oh, there's the roll. Incredibly disorienting. Just try. Uh, the seat sick bags are in the seat in front of you. Um, in the pouch, so feel free to have a book if need be. Try not to, though, because that means that you wouldn't be watching because you'd be spewing. And then what's the point? <laughs> I'm only joking, of course. If you do feel the need to, to feel the need to be sick, please don't hesitate. All right, I think that I think I've chatted about spewing for far too long now. I need to get up on the overpass. I was wrong to drop down. I've made a mistake. Oops, a daisy. Come on, Crane. Let's do a sweet. Lovely. 
Oh, nice. We can get up. Get up there. I think this is another one of those uh, quarantine areas, or at least one of these like warehouse type things. Let's do a little. Oh, we had to go around that way anyway. Well, let's hop between cars to get our agility rank up as best we can, of course. Oh, there's another police van. Hopefully, we can get it before. There's one of them coming up behind me. I can hear it. Yep. Yeah. Die already. Jeez. Oh. Heads off. And camouflage. Oh. Damn. Oh, I thought we could make it out of there. We got struck. Struck down by something. I really need to get some uh, med kits again. Keep losing my med kits all the time. Again, once per episode, just all of my med kits disappear. Ah, it's, a, it's insane. There's an absolute shortage. Well, I seem awfully far away now. Wow, what, what a poop bag. I suppose it's to the nearest safe zone. My mistake. I think there's uh, survival perks that make lockpicking easier. Which would be useful, being able to just bust on into stuff like that whenever we need it. There's the quarantine zone that I was talking about. I'm not going to do that though because that will be an absolute nightmare on hard. Ah, oh, right. Back we are. I fell. <laughs> God almighty. I'll cut to the top of the, uh, top of the thing maybe. How did I get up there before? Stand on the fence. Balance in. There you are. Perfect form, Crane. On we go. Didn't really need to cut to the top, so I might not bother. You'll see. You'll know if I did or not. You'll. you'll be oh, that was one of the fucking explosive ones. That was my bad. Oh, this is a disaster. Not doing well whatsoever. Oh, careful, careful. Try and get there quickly this time. Mount Everest for climbing loads of things. I wonder if that's just distance travelled vertically. Could be. Well, med kits are troubling, so let's get this easy log pick. Nice one. You get away from me, you vile creature. Honestly, I might just start using the gun. Just for... Just for simplicity's sake. There we go, didn't fall that time. Right, now, I'll try not to hit anything explosive and I'm not going to be tempted by that bloody police van. Oh, honestly. They weren't joking when they said a tunnel. I was expecting a tunnel into the ground, not into a mountain. Just bumped our face off of a low-hanging low-hanging sign there. Is that another one of the explosive ones? No, it's just a gassy one. I don't know what they do. Do they just do additional damage if they grab us with their acidic gas? Meet the survivors in the tunnel. I can definitely do that. I'm going to stop off for some meds first, though. Because you can never have too many med kits. That's what I've learned. Even if they do restore health a lot slower than they need to. Ah, there's a nice clear police van for us to break on into the other side, maybe. Oh, found it. There we are. Sweet spot. What have you got for me? Uh, carving hammer, I suppose. Blunt weapons seem to be effective. And we've entered the sewers. I thought we did go down into the sewers. Turns out I was correct. First, Jank was reluctant to even talk to me. But after I mentioned what I did to Rice, the saviors decided to give me... Good for you, Crane. There's our little saving icon. Okay, so we're in the sewers. I'll get this torch turned on, make sure you can see properly. Oh, the game had other ideas there. Green? This is another That's exposition cutscene. Basically, the saviors are like, you're a legend. Just go through the sewers. We'll guide you. And guide me, they will. I like his assault rifle, but sadly. Oh, we've got one too. Let's get our assault rifle out. Don't really need the torch at this point. It just affects the mood lighting. See if we can just run ahead here, follow the arrow. He's like, I'll guide you there, and there's just arrows that tell us exactly where to go. Huh. Anyhow. Oh, do we honestly actually have to wait for him to make his way? Come on, pal. In your own time. 
I will take this opportunity to equip our new, better weapons. The hook blade is the tip cleaver better than the tip cleaver. Kit tipped cleaver is the worst weapon that we've got, actually. Is it? That can't be right. 115. It's better than the composite baseball bat. And the carving hammer is better than both the heavy hewing axe and the garden sickle, but the heavy hewing axe is pretty cool. Eh, I'll keep the carving hammer for later. Oh, anyway. He's like, la la la. The saviors are pretty, pretty cool, I suppose. Follow the marked path. Oh, right, am I going... I don't understand. Do I have to, like, swim? Oh, right, yeah, I do. He's like, head down into the ship pit. I'm like, oh, man, really? Yep, that's right. In order to escape, sorry, in order to escape Haran, well, escape the slums of Haran anyway, one must swim through human feces. And now this is actually, as far as sewer levels go, I remember this one being okay. Because it's not like your typical fare. It's, uh, it's like a sort of m movement puzzle type deal that goes on, and I can get behind that. I quite enjoy the old movement puzzle charade. It's all about climbing. And it's nice, it's nice seeing them actually like build a, build a section with problem solving. What? Oh, close call there. Problem solving in mind. I'll put the gun away, we don't need the gun. Get the tip cleaver out because it'll probably be the first to break out of them once to get to... Don't want to waste it, you know. Oh, this isn't right. We'll do a sweet slide. The marked path, we head on down. And through more tunnels. Lovely, lovely tunnels. Ah. There will be infected here and there. They weren't joking. You can do this entirely. Oh, had a fall. Because I am worthless at games. Don't judge. Get away, you, you bloody villain. Alright, oh, well, this is an issue. Maybe we can. Have we got fireworks? Let's go to the fireworks. Oh shit. Up we get. Let's kill this guy up here. No, come back. Come back. He fell. I fell. Everybody fell. Right, I'm thinking of doing exactly what I did before. With the... Oh, he's down. No, I didn't mean that. Right, quickly. Is the corpse up there still? Right. Before the virals get back up, I'm going to smother myself in gore. And then immediately he's like, oh, hang on, I could have... Sorry, pal. I thought you were a... Thought you were some sort of interloper. I'm like, ugh. But in fact, I'm like, ha ha ha, inside my head. Victory is cranes. Look how delicately he twists that wheel. Lovely. And then immediately, they're on to us. Need to get out of the way though. No! Didn't die, somehow. Didn't die from the uh, explosive one. Let's see if we can head there quickly through the door. No, I'm not fucking about with you. You die. I will, I suppose, fuck about with you just for simplicity's sake. Let's get a med kit on the go. Come on. Wow, I'm just backing up. There, his head is off. Heed's off. Oh, phew. Another one. God, they're just infinitely arriving. Oh, that's all of them. Right. Let's start climbing. If we can actually. Come on. There we go. Good man, Crane. Oh! Oof. That was a. That was a hefty leap, I'll give him that, considering he was just. springing off a wall. Ooh. Careful, Crane. Safe. Good one. Good one, matey. Ooh. Safe. Right. Now. Oh, nearly had a bit of a fall there. We're going to have to exercise our shimmy skills. Finally, a situation where we're not timed, where we can use the shimmy. It's been so long. It's been so long. Now we've got to get up there, it seems. Oh, no, we don't. We've got to just go into this pipe. And then we. Uh, I had no choice. Rise has me by the balls. 
Oh, Hazan, have you shafted me, pal? You son of a bitch, Hazan. I don't even know who Hazan is. Who's Hazan? Is that like... Is he one of the folk that was just waiting back at the... Let's, uh, let's keep low. Oh, okay. So, we seem to just be getting tagged left, right and centre anyway. Swim crane, before you run out of... Before you run out of juice. And we're away. <sighs> oh, our stamina ticks down as our oxygen runs out. Tension builds. Can we get up here for some air? I hope so. Oh, that's cool. Didn't realise his hand. That was that was interesting. Done the old panic hands, as I like to call them. Right, let's get our gun at the ready. Pop a med kit. If they want to go, I'm happy to go. Aiming with an analog stick, though, so bear with me. Stay low. Wait for them to come to me. Whoa, maybe not. Wow, he just absolutely gubbed me. That was disgraceful. I'm so sorry. Whoops. Hopefully we don't have to do that little swim again. That'd be grim. A grim swim. So to speak. Right. Now where were we? Oh, he fell like a sack of ties. Let's use the military rifle because of its fully automatic capabilities. We want to just be able to fire some munition back at them. Let's get moving. Ah, uh, just slid right in the middle of them. I expected to be able to shoot while I was sliding for some reason. Well, I'm, I'm ironing out. I'm ironing it out. Right, one more time. There's only going to be two of them left. I'm sure I can handle it. Right, Crane, come on. Come on, pal, you and me. One down. Two down. Oh, shit. That was effective. Just absolutely tore through them. Where are that? Got some tasty throwing knives. $28 rifle ammo. And $53. Wow. What a haul. Now we've got to continue to find our way to Sector Zero. Truly the most deadly of all sectors, if you ask me. Oops a daisy. I think we're nearing the end of this. And suddenly the architecture changes. And that's because now... We are in a whole new area, which is quite exciting. I'll briefly show it off in this part. But I think the majority is going to take place as of... Well, this will come out on Monday, so Thursday. How exciting. Oops, a daisy. Right, now we can maybe be, can maybe be stealthy here. Maybe we can get around without causing things to kick off. Oh, they're on to me. Just hose them with bullets. Da -da -da. Body shots are effective. Unlike with weapon, uh, unlike with melee right. weapons. Have I got to? Well, oh, I've got to climb up anyway. The there was no way to avoid that. To Fair enough. Oh, the saviors! The Shh. bastards! Saviors, my arse! Who were they trying to save? To this isn't right. We need to get, need to get higher up. Got it. We'll it's do. true. Allegedly, this Troy lassie. I'm sure we can. I'm sure we can work something out with her. She seems like a lovely lass. And there we go. Now we are in an entirely new Saviors section of the map, the old town. Saviors, my ass, exactly. That's they what I said. I Me and Crane, symbiotic link. Yes, new area, and isn't it lovely? Very traditional. See, thinking back, it was pretty dumb when I said South American. This is. But the thing is, I didn't know. I didn't want to say, didn't want to generalise, but apparently it's implied it's to be in Turkey somewhere. It's so this Turkish me. architecture. Damn it. It's, been, it's definitely not South American, right. though. I don't know what I was thinking. It's time for some local talent. Troy. Local it's talent, Crane. indeed. So now we're going to find Troy in the old town. We've unlocked a new safe zone. Camden, do you copy? Crane here. Let's go Camden, can you hear me? sort something Crane. out then. Yes, yes. See if we can. Oh, boot it. Keep the garden sickle out, I feel. Oh, that's nasty looking. That could cause some wounding. 
Whoa. Yes, uh, traversing the environment here is a lot more... Uh, Jesus Christ. It's a lot more dangerous than in the slums. Just by virtue of... Uh, by virtue of how far the falls are. I'll show you just now. Give me a second while I just uh, mop up all the... All this stuff. I've got a pal called Camden. Yeah, look, that's enough to potentially kill you in one fall, especially from some of the higher buildings, so you've got to be a lot more careful when you're running around the map. Thankfully, the Old Town area is, well, if I recall correctly, it's slightly smaller than the slums. It's a little bit more compact and concise, which is good. Uh, but at any rate, we've got an objective to do. Oh yeah, see, we've got to, you've got to be a lot cleverer. You can't just—it's not a straight line anymore. We've actually got to plan things out. But there's a, there's an antizen drop there. The rises men are covering. So why don't we just try? Just delivering some bullets, but they got me anyway. I tried to fall off to the side, but there was a little bit more. Uh, more standing room than I, ex I expected there. Whoopsie. My bad. Well, that was ill-advised. It doesn't mean I'm not going to do it again if I see it. Okay, so from the top, let's try that one again. At the same time, it is harder to, harder to navigate, but there's these really little neat... neat bits that you can just jump from one to the other to get across. There is a lot of, uh, I want to say larger concentration. There's more virals and such like, if I recall. But again, uh, this is basically me experiencing this again for the first time, so please do bear with me. That's a head gone. There's another one down. One more guy. Nice try, mate. Let's bring down the infected. Oh shit, lockpicking, I didn't anticipate lockpicking. Be very careful. Nice. What's in the rise crate? Well, stolen valuables for one thing in the disaster relief on site package. Oh shit. Let's get shifted. Yeah, because of the environment, you're, um, it's quite clever. Your, your agility rank goes up naturally a lot faster, which is fun. Just because you're doing a lot more complex manoeuvres, there's a lot more diverse, quick thinking going on. So hopefully, it won't be long before we get the max agility level. At any rate, let's finish this off. Let's go speak to Troy. This is a cool save zone as well. Just goes to show. Parkour. Stay vertical. Just this rigging. There's no danger they're going to get up here. Safest place there could be. Just a bit hard to fall though. That wouldn't have been very safe. OS HJ Osha would be on this place like a, hey, I don't know, like what, like all yeah, kinds. Hey, I'm Michael. Me. Don't know who you I'm are. Michael. Troy's waiting for you in the loft. No bother. Here, Cheers, mate. And cutscene. Here we meet. It's a pleasure, mate. Uh, I'm Here's Savvy. savvy. Your with his Almost not English accent. Come on. Or rather, an English accent put on by somebody who is in England. It's good to finally put a face with the voice. Here she is. Lovely Troy. She's horribly burned, bless her. You're looking for Jade Alden, but she's still a handsome yeah, lady. Yeah. Have you seen her? I mean, you know where she is? We're looking for Jade and she knows where Jade is. Is the moral of this story. Jade, this is Troy. Do you copy? Go ahead, Troy. Jay Bother. Hey, it's Crane. Now, I know you're headed for Dr. Camden, but it's now. surrounded by zombies. So effectively, we're gonna go help. We're gonna go help Jade. At the university. I think we'll get over there, and then we'll probably end this part. I'll see if there's... I'll just take a little sort of sightseeing tour on the way go... On, on the way there. I won't go... I won't go straight. Let's do a badass zip line right off the side. Sweet. Keep our speed. Obviously slowing down slightly on the climb. Eventually, this area is designed with the max level movement skills in mind, so uh, bear that. Bear that in Copy. mind. What is it, Troy? Savvy has an idea how to break through the Savvy's got an idea. Savvy's always got an idea, bless him. Here's a little diversion here. Let's try and clear these fools out. Oh, Jesus. Oh, buggery. We've got a bit. Let's see if we can't clear a bit of distance and just gun them down. 
Really? Mister, take a bullet to the head and keep going. The one zombie that can. The little zombie that could. Now that he's now that we're getting decent weapons, you see we're just tearing through the individual zombies. This is where it sort of things si Hello. <laughs> things uh, simplify slightly. Oh this garden sickle, jeez, oh that just hacked into bits. You dead? Now you're dead. Quick way to tell if a zombie's dead actually when it's on the ground is with the uh, is with the stomp. It won't give you the prompt unless they're dead. Uh, unless they're alive, sorry. Not dead. Otherwise you could just boot dead zombies heads off left, right and centre. Obviously they locked this lassie in and then turned into zombies themselves. It was too late. She's like, for God's sake, I've already bitten you. They're like, no, that's not how it works. Little did they know, that is in fact entirely how it works. And that's how you make a safe area. Safe zone unlocked. Nice one. That was simple. Anyhow, let's go talk to Jade at the university. Let's get on that. We'll maybe activate the first objective before uh, before anything else. Actually, I think the, I don't, I'm not sure if the university is a mission or if it's or if it's just plot. Depending on which. I'll, at any rate, I'll get to the first stage of the next mission before I end this part. There's two. I think that'll be two big zombies standing over one of the uh, Anna's and crates. Either way, we're not in a position to be handling that. So we're not going to handle that. We're just going to skip it for now. Do you want to crane? There we go. That's what I was looking for, honestly. Let's head this way. And upsy daisy. There we go. At the university. And a little hop to get up. Yep. That <laughs> well, that worked, I suppose. Right, let's go get Jade. Had a fall. Doesn't matter. There's a guard. Let's go inside. Yes, this is just another safe zone, which is pretty cool. Inside the old library of the university. Because that's where knowledge lies. And knowledge is power, as we know. No sign of Jade. Damn it. No sign of Jade. Ask the survivors about Jade. Can do that. This guy. Can you help? Yes. Yes. It's a mirror. Well. Fidan. His name is. Oh, we've asked the survivors. We've got to leave the university. Oh, we can deliver a drop to a quartermaster. Well, we might as well do that just now. He's along here. Whoa. Good to see you again. Oh, it's Spike. Spike. Jamie Fox, how, how did you, did you get, get here? He does look like there. Jamie Fox. That's not racist. Spike's like, you wouldn't even believe how I got here, pal. Drop delivered. Let's uh, see if there's anything. Give us a med kit, nice guy. Short bone and knife. 33 damage. Be serious, Spike. What'd you expect me to do with that? Craft a delicious filet. Mignon. Anyhow, let's leave the university Jade, and proceed to our next you objective. Jade, can you hear it's across me? the way. Troy, this is Crane. Jade, you, you are contrary, and it is frustrating. Oh my word, just back and forth and back and forth. Why, what do I, what do I have to see? You have to all see kinds, mate. Just get back here, all right? I'm serious. They've seen a zombie that's managed to eat its own head. And that is truly one of the most groundbreaking sights a human being could ever perceive. Wouldn't you say so? I know I would. In fact, I know I would so well that I just did. What do you make of that, eh? What do you make of that? Sorry, I'm exporting videos right now. I needed to... Do that for he's just getting chewed on. Lots of police around here. Quite telling that there weren't very many police around the slum area. Commentary. Get some delicious chemicals. And a cash reward. $77. Oh, that was a bit ambitious. Made it though. Let's do a climb. Oh. Whew. Right. On the loading screens, it's saying Dying Light Enhanced Edition. I swear, if I have only just started doing a Dying Light Let's Play when there's an Enhanced Edition coming out, that is just my luck. <laughs> ah, I'm only kidding. Doesn't matter, I was planning on doing this for ages anyway, might as well just get it done. I could just I could just lie. I'll just say it's the enhanced edition, nobody'll ever know. No, I'm just kidding. I would never do that. 
because I would be slaughtered by the internet. Nobody needs that. Ups a daisy, and we return. Oh, good lord. What an effort. What an effort. He's like, come in, hey, come and have a spy of this. Come and have a spy of this, lads. Come and have a buy. I still can't believe it. I think this is about the internal there. global relief effort document surfaced today that if they're oh, right, so they found out that the GRE's in on it. We're like, oh that's that's terrible. So it is. I cannot believe they would do that. What are we gonna get? Nimble hands. Searching dead bodies faster. Yeah, that's, that's quite interesting. Moon stars, booster XL, shields. Yeah, let's do nimble hands. We can search bodies faster. That's good. More loot. Go meet with Michael in the sewers now. God. Well, let's go. Go. Let's we'll go back to the sewers. Shame that we just get to this cool new area and then all of a sudden we're back in the sewers. Typically. Well, we'll see. Anti-gadoid gun. That sounds cool. Like this big building. <laughs> Lovely. Up we get. Doing sweet hops. Right. We'll get with Michael in the sewers. And then that'll be it for today. I have had a good time in this session. This was much better than the last session, I must say. The last session was tough, but now we've just broken through that barrier. We're getting some good skills now. Things are picking up. Nice. What the fuck was that? Just a big old explosion. There's a salesman down there, but to be honest, we're actually quite good for equipment right now, for once. Right. No, we're not too far away now. Feeling a little, feeling safe, feeling ambitious. Let's take it to the, take it to the ground. Got no time to get into that uh, van. So instead, we'll just head around the outside. Hop on over here. Oh God. Hello, friend. Jeez, oh, he died quickly. I'm used to them taking about 50 to kill. And we're in the sewer. That's the easiest way of doing that, I'd imagine. Don't mess about. Just plop down. Oh, oh, close one. Struggling. Nice. And um, we're in the sewers. Okay, well that was a nice little tour of the new area. Hopefully we'll see more next time. I don't imagine we'll be in the sewers for very long. But that is going to be it for this episode. I, um, this was a lot more brief than it is normally. I think I'm going to stick to that. Rather than having big 45 minutes long 45 minute long episodes, I'll try and stick to about an hour spot on every single day, rather than increase. And obviously, if I'm doing one-offs and such like, it'll be different. But yes, a decent effort, I feel. So it's coming up on half an hour now. So hopefully, that's a little bit more palpable for the audience. I hope it will be. Anyway, I have been crying. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Uh, leave a like, comment, or subscribe. I love all three of them. I'll take any of them. I especially enjoy comments because then I'll get feedback and feedback is delicious. Anyhow, I hope you've had a good time. I've had a good time. Have a nice afternoon, a day, evening, um, bar mitzvah, whatever you're doing. Just make sure it's excellent. Bye-bye now. I'll see you later.